Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching this video. I know I've not filmed for quite some time. It's because I've been working from home, I've been doing everything from home and it can be a little bit stressful and it actually made me very lazy. How are y'all doing with this pandemic going on? Me staying at home, I, it's very very difficult for me to actually do a foundation review. So today since I'm up like really really early, I woke up around like 8.30 in the morning. Today's foundation review is from Lancome. And it's the tint. Okay, I'm not gonna speak Frenish. Frenish? Frenish! French with a little bit of Spanish. Okay, so I'm not gonna butcher the name. I think it's the tint Idoli Ultra Wear. And this is from Lancome. The box is really, really shiny. I'll show you the bottle. So this foundation is a 24 hour wear and comfort. And it's supposed to be retouch free. And this foundation has SPF. 15 in it. I got myself the shade 055, okay? It is an oil-free, long-wearing liquid foundation that delivers medium to full coverage and leaves a natural-looking velvet matte finish up to 24 hours. It's supposed to give you full coverage. It's supposed to be comfortable. It's supposed to be non-greasy, non-thick. It has SPF 15 in it. It's supposed to reduce redness. I mean, it's supposed to like cover redness, pores, imperfection. It's supposed to matte your, your skin up to 24 hours. For the remaining retouch free, they say meaning your makeup doesn't need to retouch and provides transfer resistant coverage. Plus, it's infused with pellet and silica, absorbing oil for a shine free wear. Okay, we'll test this out. So this foundation actually retails for $68. So moving on, let's get right into this video. So my base, I'm gonna go in first with the Vitamin Nectar Glow Juice Antioxidant Serum and then I'll go in with the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Capsule in the serum. Then I'm gonna prime my face with the Tata the Cell Canvas because I'm gonna use my favourite primer like how normally I would use my foundation. I'm gonna apply the foundation on one side of my face. I'm just gonna take like three pumps of foundation on the back of my hand, use my fingers, put it on my face and blend it out with foundation brush. You can use a beauty blender if you want. It's not a very runny texture. It has a very nice texture, almost like a very creamy light texture. This is how actually it looks. It has a really, really nice, a flawless, natural looking finish. Not too greasy. And this is the other side, which is my bare skin. Hello. Okay, bye-bye. So I'm gonna run away really quickly right now to do the rest of my makeup and then I will come back. My full first impression review on this Lancome foundation. I really, really like this foundation. Okay, it's very natural looking on the face and this foundation is a buildable foundation in a sense of coverage-wise. It can go from medium to full, depending how much you want. You want a natural looking finish or you want it medium. Or more. And one thing about the smell, yes, it has a very beautiful floral scent. The scent actually goes away as you're doing your rest of your makeup. Right now, it is 11.06 a.m. in the morning. I'm gonna let this set for four hours. I'll come back and then I'll come back at eight hours and show you guys the results. Hey guys, I am back after four and a half hours and yes, I know my outfit has changed. It's because I had to do a lot of housework so and I perspired a lot. Okay, I, literally like my face was dripping. What do you guys think? I really like the, the, the coverage and the look of the foundation. It still looks very flawless. And for four, after four hours, I can definitely say it is still holding up in place. And I actually did like pat my face down. So the foundation didn't lift up. It didn't actually make my face look patchy. So that is good. Hey guys, I'm back and it's almost nine hours of foundation on my face. Yes, my face is looking a little bit down. It's because guys, I took a nap. No joking, I'm not joking. I actually took a nap for two hours. That's why my eyes is red. Never ever sleep with mascara. She is waterproof. It's just irritating my eyes. Okay, besides that, after taking a nap, I don't even see... Oh my god, he is still so mad. Wow. I don't see any patchiness on my face. Yes, my oils has come out on my nose. Looking absolutely beautiful and flawless still, guys. So 
So my overall thoughts and reviews upon this foundation, it's $68. It is really, really a very, very good foundation and it's super lightweight. You cannot actually feel that you're wearing foundation on your face. That is what makes it so amazing. It's so lightweight, yet it has the coverage and it's long lasting. This wraps up my video. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so much. Stay home, stay safe. I love you. Bye guys.